hello guys welcome back again to my youtube channel i am daisy and today let's just get uncomfortable for a minute and let us talk about taking accountability for your own behavior oh gosh guys this video is going to be very uncomfortable especially for me <laughs> but i just have to do it regardless so um let us face the reality most of the times there are always two sides to a coin so in every situation that happened or in any situation that we were involved in the reality is that there was a part that we played and most of the times what we portray it's as if we were innocent but the reality of the matter is that we also mess up and we were not innocent as like compared to how we get uh, things out there and today i just wanted us to talk about the uncomfortable part of accepting accountability for your own behavior now this comes at a time when i was talking to my sister uh sometime and then there's just like an issue happening and, and then i remember i just told her you know what whatever is happening right now this is the reality of the matter you have no control over what someone else is doing the only thing you have control is your behavior how you react to it how you choose to take it and how you choose to see things i mean that is the only thing that you have control over but uh, most of the time when something happens let's just take like a real situation of a relationship most of the times when a relationship ends guys there is that stage of denial then there is a stage of um now heart like it hits you a million times how hurt you are you know and then now when you start the healing process and then you heal you heal and then you get to now a point of accountability now you're like yes the relationship ended maybe he cheated maybe you things just did not work out you know because that one also happens sometimes and in all these things i was not a hundred percent innocent the times imagine guys you mess up like i mess up like we mess up like we are the problem there is someone out there in who you are the bad one in the story and getting to a place where you have the maturity of accepting accountability for your behavior and not putting it on the other person oh i behaved in this manner because this is how they talked to me or this is how they treated me or this is how uh, i was this much pissed and guys let me tell you i'm saying this video because this is literally me i'm not even saying from a place of innocence or anything like I feel like I'm attacking myself, but I'm like, I'm saying, the, I'm doing this video for me to help myself also. Like, there is literally no way that I'm innocent in this. So, you get to a point where you're like, <laughs> imagine nili mess, imagine nili mongele shavi baya, and now you have to take accountability for any consequence that will come as a result of your behavior it's high time we stopped pointing fingers at other people and looked at ourselves you know yesterday i was thinking even if someone disrespects you okay yesterday um, literally i was thinking before i uploaded this video even if someone disrespects you once disrespects you again and then they disrespect you again and again you know when it comes to disrespect this is what i say it doesn't matter if you know as June. As long as they feel disrespected, imagine like that is it. That is where I draw the line. Now, how can someone disrespect you those many times, and then you're still pointing fingers at them instead of pointing fingers at you? Why are you allowing the disrespect to continue? Gosh, why are you allowing the disrespect to continue? Why are you allowing them to treat you the way they treat you? Imagine, 
taking accountability of your behavior it's not all about nearly corsair no it's even about how other people treat you that is how they do to you but how many times have you accepted toxic behavior from people a million times without taking accountability of yourself like you just like you you know you just have to get to a point of like this look we're not going to allow this we me and you <laughs> me and you are not going to allow any disrespect talking to me in a way it's not about them remember you don't have control over what they do you have control over how you react to what they do if it means cutting some people off i know that's hard huh imagine you have to because now you're taking accountability of how you're reacting to how they are treating you so guys me today this video it's going to be like i think one of my shortest video but be accountable of everything that is happening to you be accountable you know yesterday i, I was just thinking like most of the times we get so much engrossed with the drama that is going around us that we forget who we are what values we portray you know most of the times into tukufanya kitu mbaya we just go and you're like imagine they really hurt me and now you're waiting for an apology from them so <clears throat> you know guys meta sometimes so shanga like you know I had um a couple of times it was just need to like acknowledge I've been hurt and then nitembeze miguni and like I move on do I really have to wait for someone who hurt me to come and tell me I'm so sorry I know how much I hurt you for me to start healing and guys there are some things we are so unfair to ourselves as so so much tunajipenda lakini ukiangalia vile tunajitrick and then another one the last one you too hard on yourself you damn too hard on yourself you know, it just gets to a point where by you so hard on yourself it's either forgiving other people then you just forgiving yourself gosh i mean this one has hit me like a thousand this is me I'm so hard of, on myself. I remember like I was even praying yesterday and I told God, the same grace that I give to other people, help me give the same grace to myself because I need it. Like to me this thing of self-love and self-care, I just look it from a different angle. And I know like this topic was insightful and it helped you and guys, please Please let us take accountability for our own behaviors. We are not as innocent as we portray ourselves out there. Mhm. Hata -mm. mimi I'm not as innocent. I am not kuna places nazo nimeban nimechoma. Gosh. So, nimeban like I have choma. <laughs> I have banned. <laughs> but it it's high time I just say like yeah I messed. And Daisy from today me and you we are going to do better than this we are going to do better than this okay so guys that is all that i had for you today however you, you just to take this video that is on you but remember you got control over only you and your actions what people do that is upon them don't stress yourself you cannot change it you can never change it if they chose to lie to you if they manipulated you if i don't know they did whatever they did imagine that is on them and don't don't let someone else's behavior change who you really are don't give people so much power in your life to that matter aki subscribe in i don't follow my bitches and go kuja inbox kunyambia okay there is this youtube so inside please can you just comment here okay yeah Please. That is all that I have for you. Bye. I love you and God loves you. Mm. I'm I'm in a very good mood today. You guys, but uh, I love you and God loves you. Bye. -bye.